One of the strongest components to a traumatic experience is, is the long-lasting and enduring pervasive um, feelings of shame that are a result of traumatic experiences. Um, these, these experiences also come with uh, feelings of rejection and abandonment and lead uh, people with trauma to have questions um, and struggle with questions of why. Why me? Um, what, why wasn't I protected? What, what, why wasn't I spared from this? Um, and so that's something that's very core. And so shame is really is rooted in the core of identity and who one believes he or she is and a sense of worthiness. It's different than guilt, for example, that's associated with behaviors and wrongdoing. And it's a little, it's di different also than self-esteem, which is associated more with competence and judgment of others. Shame is really more at the core of identity. And so it also leads, to, for those who have religious uh, backgrounds, to not only why, but why, not why me, but why God, in a sense of questioning benevolence and uh, defining your identity as, well, there must be something wrong with me. Um, shame is also something that's a shrouded emotion. It's, um, it hides behind other things, such as perfectionism, um, blaming, criticism, domestic violence, um, and clearly addictions. Um, both substance addictions and process addictions. Um, here at Timberline Knowles, we use a lot of things like DBT and radical acceptance, ACT and creative hopelessness, or even the 12th step to address uh, the issues of shame. But shame research really uh, points to the corrective for shame as exposure, but more better said would be a sense of vulnerability and enabling yourself to be vulnerable. And as our women here find the strength and the encouragement and the support to be vulnerable with one another in groups um, and in their sessions and uh, recovery process, they find a sense of connection, they find a sense of empowerment. Um, and this, and truly, the sense of connection and empowerment is the bedrock of recovery. And it's the foundation of a restored sense of hope.